So guys, why could the circular pillar hold more books compared to the square pillar? And why could the square pillar hold more books than the triangle one? Confused? Even I was. So now let's understand why did that happen. Now if you observe a triangle has how many corners? 1, 2, 3. A square has how many corners? 1, 2, 3, 4. Now for a circle there are how many corners? Infinite. This is a corner, this can be a corner, this can be a corner because it's turning everywhere. So let's, uh, let's assume infinite for this, 4 for this and 3 corners for this. So all the weight of your book over here was coming on your 3 corners. So imagine you are in a classroom and there are just 3 students holding your blackboard. It's going to be painful right? Your hands are going to be paining and you eventually will drop it. But if imagine there are 4 students holding your blackboard. That is these four corners were holding the weight of the books. It would be a little more easier. Yes. But now imagine the whole classroom is holding the board. Everybody's put their hands up and holding the board together. That would be easier. Y'all could hold the board for longer. That's how over here there were so many hands holding the book. And over here there were only four hands. One, two, three, four. So this could hold a little less. This could hold very less number of books because it had only three hands. And that's why if you observe, we have a lot of circular pillars. But then now you can ask me a question that, ma'am, why can we see a lot of square ones and very few circle ones even if this is stronger? The question is, to make these pillars, the companies require a lot more money. So that's why these are much more expensive. Secondly, a square pillar looks anytime more good, aesthetically very beautiful compared to the circle ones. So even if these are more stronger than the square ones, we observe these a lot more. Thirdly, if we have square pillars and we have to put circle pillars, these will be required more. So if there is a wall, if there is one floor that needs to be uh, held up, this would require two of these pillars and we would require four of these pillars. So even if they use these pillars, because they look nice and are less expensive, you require many number of pillars like the square ones to hold the weight compared to the circle ones. I hope you had fun stacking your books on these fun pillars. If you want to do more of these activities, do check the other activities on the website. Thank you.